Dubai is once again pushing the boundaries of innovation with Al Maktoum International Airport, poised to become the world's largest airport. This $35 billion mega hub will cover 70 square kilometers, handling 260 million passengers and 12 million tons of cargo annually. With five parallel runways and 400 aircraft gates, it's set to redefine global air travel. But why did Dubai undertake this colossal project when Dubai International is already one of the largest? Positioned at the crossroads of global air routes, Dubai has swiftly grown into a central hub for international travel. However, this rapid growth brought with it significant challenges. Dubai International Airport, once a marvel of modern engineering, began to buckle under the pressure of its own success. As one of the busiest airports in the world, it reached its capacity limits, struggling to manage the surging number of passengers. Overcrowding, delays, and operational inefficiencies became routine threatening to undermine the city's ambitious vision. The situation came to a head in April 2024, when severe weather struck Dubai, exposing the vulnerabilities of its aviation infrastructure. On April 17th, heavy flooding and road blockages caused unprecedented disruptions at Dubai International Airport. Terminal 1, the airport's busiest, had to restrict access to travelers with confirmed departures, leading to massive overcrowding, stranded passengers, and widespread flight delays. This crisis highlighted the urgent need for a new solution. Faced with mounting pressure, Dubai's leaders made a pivotal decision. Rather than merely expanding the existing airport, they chose to embark on an audacious new project that would redefine air travel. The idea was to create a global gateway, capable of handling an unprecedented volume of passengers and cargo while offering a seamless, world-class travel experience. The vision for this new airport took shape in the early 2000s. In 2006, the foundation stone was laid for what would become the world's largest airport. The project was meticulously planned to be future-proof, with an eye on the next several decades of growth. The initial phase focused on developing runways and cargo facilities, setting the stage for a massive expansion. By 2010, Al Maktoum International Airport opened its doors to cargo operations, marking the beginning of a new chapter in Dubai's aviation history. In 2013, the airport welcomed its first commercial passenger flight, signaling its readiness to assume the mantle of the world's largest aviation hub. This was a strategic move to ensure that Dubai would remain at the forefront of global aviation for generations. As the city transitions all major operations to the state-of-the-art facility, the question remains, what engineering feats and innovations were required to bring this audacious project to life? The design of Al Maktoum International, which spans a staggering 70 square kilometers, is nothing short of revolutionary. The airport will feature five parallel runways, each meticulously engineered for independent operation. This setup will allow the simultaneous takeoff and landing of aircraft, dramatically increasing the airport's capacity. With a target of handling over 260 million passengers annually, nearly three times the capacity of Dubai International Airport, this new facility will eclipse every other airport in the world. Moreover, the airport will manage up to 12 million tons of freight each year, solidifying its role as a critical node in global trade. To support this massive capacity, the airport will have 400 aircraft gates, strategically positioned across multiple terminals. These gates are designed to minimize taxi times for aircraft and reduce delays for passengers. The terminals themselves are a marvel of modern engineering, featuring advanced automation systems that streamline everything from check-in to boarding. Automated baggage handling systems will ensure that luggage is processed quickly and accurately, while biometric screening technology will enhance security without causing bottlenecks. One of the standout features of Al Maktoum International is its automated people mover system. This high-tech transit network is being built to help passengers navigate the vast terminal complex with ease. Initially, four stations will be operational, providing quick and efficient transportation between key areas of the airport. As the airport expands, this network will grow to include more stations, ensuring that passengers can move seamlessly from one terminal to another, even during peak travel times. The construction process is being meticulously planned and executed in phases to ensure that each stage is completed with the utmost precision. The first phase, already well underway, focuses on the construction of Concourse 1. This massive structure, stretching 2.7 kilometers in length and covering nearly 1.8 million square meters, is equivalent in size to all three concourses of Dubai International Airport combined. Concourse 1 will house 100 contact gates, designed to accommodate the largest aircraft in operation today and ensure that passengers can board quickly and efficiently. Adjacent to Concourse 1, a new terminal building is taking shape. 
This terminal will serve as the heart of the airport's operations, offering a range of world-class amenities to enhance the passenger experience. From luxury lounges to high-end retail shops and gourmet dining options, the terminal is designed to cater to every need of the modern traveler. The layout is intuitive, with clear signage and easy navigation, ensuring that even first-time visitors can find their way around with ease. As the construction progresses, the airport's capacity will continue to grow. The first phase also includes the addition of two new runways, bringing the total to four. These runways are being built with advanced materials and construction techniques to ensure that they can handle the intense traffic expected at the airport. With the ability to accommodate more takeoffs and landings per hour than any other airport in the world, Al Maktoum International is set to become the most efficient airport globally. Looking ahead, the next phase of construction will see the addition of another concourse identical to Concourse 1. This new structure will further boost the airport's capacity, adding more gates and expanding the internal transit network. Three additional people mover stations will be introduced, making it even easier for passengers to navigate the sprawling facility. This phase will also include the construction of two more runways, bringing the total to six. This increase in runway capacity is crucial for managing the high volume of air traffic that the airport is expected to handle. Al Maktoum International Airport's final phase will bring together some of the most advanced civil engineering techniques to ensure the seamless integration of Concourse 3, Concourse 4, and the East Terminal with the existing infrastructure. The construction will involve extensive use of prefabricated and modular building techniques, which will not only speed up the construction process, but will also ensure high precision and quality control. These techniques allow for the rapid assembly of large sections of the terminal buildings, reducing on-site construction time and minimizing disruption to ongoing airport operations. The concourses and terminal will feature advanced load-bearing structures made of high-strength, lightweight materials that can withstand the harsh desert climate while supporting large spans without the need for numerous internal supports, thereby maximizing usable space within the terminals. The location of Al Maktoum International, within the Dubai South District, plays a critical role in the airport's integration with the Etihad Rail and the expanded Metro Line. The airport's proximity to the Jebel Ali port and its position along key trade and transit routes within the UAE make it an ideal hub for both passenger and cargo operations. The rail and metro extensions are being designed with minimal environmental disruption in mind, employing advanced tunneling techniques under the airport to connect the new terminals directly with the existing transport networks. These projects will involve cutting-edge tunneling machinery and the use of reinforced concrete to ensure stability in the sandy soil conditions of Dubai. The integration of these transport systems will be meticulously planned to allow for the efficient movement of passengers and goods, linking the airport not only to Dubai, but to other major cities such as Abu Dhabi, Sharjah, and beyond, creating a truly interconnected transportation hub. Sustainability has been a central focus throughout the construction of Al Maktoum International. The airport is being equipped with numerous green technologies to minimize its environmental impact. Solar panels are being installed on the roofs of the terminal buildings, generating renewable energy to power various airport operations. Energy-efficient lighting and climate control systems are being implemented throughout the facility to reduce power consumption, while water conservation measures, such as rainwater harvesting and efficient irrigation, will help manage the airport's water use sustainably. The construction of Al Maktoum International Airport has not been without its challenges. The sheer scale of the project presents numerous logistical hurdles coordinating the efforts of thousands of workers, ensuring that materials and equipment are delivered on time, and maintaining the highest standards of quality, all while adhering to a tight timeline, is no small feat. The extreme weather conditions in Dubai, with temperatures often exceeding 40 degrees Celsius, add an additional layer of complexity to the construction process. To mitigate these challenges, state-of-the-art construction techniques and materials are being employed, and work schedules are carefully planned to avoid the hottest parts of the day. As construction continues, the anticipation grows for what will undoubtedly be a game-changing development in global aviation. Al Maktoum International Airport is more than just an infrastructure project. It's a bold statement of Dubai's commitment to innovation and excellence. When completed, it will not only alleviate the pressure on existing facilities, but will also set a new benchmark for airports worldwide, ensuring that Dubai remains at the forefront of the aviation industry for generations to come. Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates on groundbreaking projects like this.